Namaste guys welcome to this new tutorial so in this video I am going to teach you how to make a simple flower by using surface commands in SOLIDWORKS so let's start so select the top plane click on sketch okay after that draw click on spline now we are going to draw the spline press escape click on center line select this point and this escape select this line make it vertical and move this point to here now click on mirror entities select this and this click ok now we have to make sure that this sketch is closed so draw a straight line Click OK. Now go to surfaces. If you are not able to see surface command, simply right click on surface and click on the surfaces. OK, and you will see surfaces. Now exit the sketch. Click on filled surface. It automatically select the surface. OK, click OK. Now select this. Click on free form click on add curves uh, that is basically going to uh, that is we are basically going to use uh, to add curves uh, that are going to modify here you see the green line so basically i want the curve uh, uh, in vertical direction so click on flip direction so select them uh, make sure that your green line is in the middle click ok now add another lines After adding three lines, again click on add curves. Okay. Now click on add points. You can add the points as per your requirement. Now click on add points again. Now after that, select this point, move it y axis. Select this point, move it toward y axis. Select this point again, move it towards y axis. A question as your mind why I have to, uh, make three green lines? Try to make this command by using single green line, and you will realize uh, why I use three green lines like this. Okay, now click OK. Now go to insert features, go to flex. Select this. Enter the angle as per your requirement. I am entering 30 degree. Let's say enter the more angle. Let's say 60 degree. Click OK. Now select the top plane. Press Ctrl plus 8 for normal screen to the view. And click on sketch. Let's make the circle. Give it a dimension as per your requirement. I am giving it a diameter of 30 mm. Click on extrude. Click on reverse direction. Click offset. Increase the distance. Click on reverse direction as well. Click OK. Now here you can see doesn't this flower doesn't have a thickness. Okay. I don't remember what it's called. So select this. Go to surface click on thicken uh, basically it means thickness select the surface uh, let's decrease the thickness to 3 mm okay here you see that thickness is going above the surface i want the thickness go below the surface so I'll select this one here you can see it is now below the surface click ok now Go to features, click on circular pattern. Select this. Increase or decrease the number of entities as per your requirement. Now when you click OK, there might be chance that you might some face error. Here you can see. So the best way to do is click on bodies. Select this one. Click OK. 
so now we got our flower now let's give it some color to make it look nice so right click on it click appearances click on part now go here go to organic wood remember i'm just showing uh, some work but it can, it is up to you which one you want to select so you can select whatever you want okay so this is how we made a simple flower in swordworks i hope you guys like this tutorial and i am going to make the complex one for example how to use complex uh, surface command to make complex things uh, in future onwards so next time onwards you will see more cool and awesome tutorial and this is the last tutorial or for this year okay i hope you guys like this if you have any doubts and queries make sure you ask in comments thanks for watching and have a great day namaste